Let's go over whether a Wi-Fi owner can see your browsing history. Now, if you're on somebody's router or at home or at a business and you're wondering, can they see which specific apps that you use or which websites you visit, I'll walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, the way that it works with your device, your iPhone, your Android, your computer, whatever you may have, is your device is connected to a router which is then connected to the internet. So various websites, all that stuff. So when you load up a website and say go to apple.com or whatever, your phone is sending a signal from your phone to the router that says, get me apple.com. And then it goes to apple.com's servers and brings that website back. So essentially all of that information is going to the router. However, you can also go into your settings and find out what exactly your router is tracking by tapping on Wi-Fi. Tap the little I right next to the Wi-Fi. And then on here, we just need to scroll down to the router IP address. Now I can copy and, uh, and uh, paste this into a web browser and I'll show you kind of what it looks like and some caveats to this. So I'm pasting in the IP address for my router, which will allow me to connect directly to that router. Now on here, if I go in here and for instance, I go into the, let's go to diagnostics and you can run diagnostics or go to the logs here. So this will look different depending on which router you specifically have but you'll be able to see a variety of different source IP addresses and destination IP addresses. This is an indication of which websites and apps that I have used or anyone has browsed on my router. Keep in mind, it doesn't show you simple things like apple.com. It will show you the IP address. So depending on if you're in a business that tracks all those IP addresses and gets an idea of which websites those are, it can decipher that. But if you're just a random person, you might be looking at some of these IP addresses and say to yourself, I don't necessarily know what that means, which website that specifically is. Now, keep in mind, again, your phone or your device connects to your router and then connects to some other third party website or app. If you want to hide your browsing history, maybe you're at a coffee shop or somewhere else that you would prefer them not know which websites you're visiting, you can always choose to turn on a VPN. What this does is it takes your phone, it connects from your phone, to your router, but instead of directly connecting to say apple.com, you connect to the VPN first, and then that VPN connects to apple.com and sends it all the way back. So what your router or your Wi-Fi owner actually sees is just incoming and outgoing traffic to that VPN, but they don't ultimately know what that information entails inside of that, where that original information came from, which website or app. So just open up the app store here and all you need to do is just search for a VPN or on a computer, just search for a VPN. There are loads of free VPNs. Just download and install one and turn it on and all of your browsing history will be protected. No one else will be able to see it. They'll just be able to see that there's traffic to and from that VPN. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.